We're good. Hey, Roxy. What up, Juicy? Yo, what's up? It's your boy EJ. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. It's your boy. I'm out here chilling with my dogs, man. It's not too hot out here. It's kind of chill. It's not cool at all. Don't get me wrong. It's not cool. But it's chill. So I've already cleaned out all the kennels. Did that earlier. Just got the shower. Um, so we had a couple, uh, there's some rain come. So I, I dug out the shit that I put inside of here. Cause I, first I had like some pellets. First thing I put down was rocks, you know? I put the rocks down and then I came back with the pellets. Well, the pellets is like um, horse bedding, which is perfect. If it was all on solid concrete, wants to dog piss and shit, you just scoop it out, throw it away. But I put it on top of a gravel, which turned into like some sand mist or some shit. It was just bad. So I've been slowly but surely removing all that to get that away. Um, now I just got to figure out what I'm going to do as far as, like, what I'm going to do in the front, because, like, I don't like this. You know what I'm saying? It, it looks sewage like, um, like right here, how it's holding water. Well, of course, like, in an hour or so, it's my job because it's fucking Houston, but I don't like that. You see how dirty her feet is and shit like that? And yeah, I gotta, I gotta go in her thing and clean this completely out. I didn't do it yesterday. But she's like, she's real super duper hyper, bro. So I have to um, make sure all the dogs are put up. Cause she's super alpha too. I have to make sure all the dogs are put up before I do that. So I'll do that later today. After all the dogs are up, she can't be out. She can't be out with other dogs. She just, it's just too much. By herself, she's perfect though. Which I will demonstrate soon. I'm gonna put, her, uh, put all the dogs up and let her out. Come on, Chloe. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Zeus. Zeus, come on. No, Chloe. Let's go, Zeus. Zeus, come on. See. See how wet his shit is right there? I don't like that. I gotta figure it out. I think I'm gonna just concrete this whole thing. Like, all this shit, everything up. Come on, Juice.
Roxy, let's go. Roxy. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Roxy. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, mama. Come on, fat girl. Roxy, let's go. So, at first I had, I had this cut off. Like I had like half and half, and I had a dog house right here, and you know. But these are XL dog houses, which I shouldn't even got because they can really stand up in this shit. These are two hundred dollars, bro, and it's too big. So I took out one and a half pound, and I just left the four or five by tens. So so he's going on right now. Come on, Roxy. She has no intentions on on going in the town. I just don't want two pregnant girls out at the same time, emotion high. And then I just don't I just I just want to avoid all type of any unnecessary fighting that I can prevent. I wanna stop it. And I don't, know, I don't really trust Myla. She's bit every dog here, but Navy. Navy, I don't have to worry about it. You see how big Navy is? See that? There's 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 not too many dogs that's just gonna fuck with him. And she definitely not. She know better. She won't even bite back at him. She won't growl at him, bite at him, none of that. Come on, Roxy. Come on, girl. Sheesh. You need a bath, too? Everybody needs baths. So, it's been raining and shit, so I'm going to give him a bath, uh, I think, like three days, maybe. It's like a stretch where it's going to be a bunch of hot days, especially where I can give him a bath and the yard will still be dry. Go, go, kennel. Roxy, Roxy, come on. With her high energy, if I got high, maybe he gonna get on her. He don't really, he don't like all that extra stuff. Like what she doing right now, all that, that panting and going back and forth. And, she does this shit all day. Like she has no chill. She can be out all day. The moment you let her in there, she <laughs> fucking crazy dog. Come on, girl. You see how the other one's chill? Zeus can one of his dog cows. Chloe's is chilling. Roxy's trying to piss me off. Come on. Roxy. Roxy. Smack her ass. Let's go. Roxy. Where you going? Come on. Let's go. Roxy. Bring your ass. Bring your ass. Bring your ass. Bring your ass. You tell us enough. Let's go, Navy. Out of there. Look at Nate. He like need to chill out. He gonna follow her around until she calm down. Play you see how big Nile is, and look how big Navy is over her. So that's what's coming. They puppies coming. If she took, who fucking knows? I don't know if she took. I know I can go get a um. I know I can go get like a test done to see. But I'm not gonna pay no money to see if she's pregnant or not. If she's pregnant, she's pregnant. She's not. She's not. Me going to go see if she's pregnant or not ain't gonna change the fact that she is or isn't. So that's a waste of money. Stop going to get fucking tests done to see if your dog is pregnant. That shit is pointless. 
give it a fucking a couple weeks. The first day you can go to see if she's pregnant, which is 30 days. It takes fucking two months to have a kid, so it would be another 30 days. Why would you go get a test when you would know in a week, in a few weeks? You would know in less than a month since you're going to have them, and then two weeks from the day where you can go get her to get tested. She'd be fucking huge, you know? So I'm not going to take her to go get a fucking test to see if she's, uh, she's pregnant. I'm just not doing it. You know? So we'll see. She prayed that she's going to have puppies, and then you guys will be alerted when she starts getting bigger or some shit like that. But as of now, I'm not doing it. What's going on, man? These are the only two dogs that can be out together when it comes down to her. Well, I can have Zeus out with her, but she tried to fight Zeus maybe like a week ago. She tried to fight Zeus like a week ago. And he whooped her ass like two seconds and she stopped instantly. Like he got on her ass real quick and she stopped. Um, she know the difference between boys and females, so when it comes down to the female, she's she all will and dearly to bite and maybe hurt and all that type of shit. But the boys, they're just too they're too much. So she don't even like she tried it with Zeus, she never tried it with Navy. She's never tried it with Navy. She tried it with Zeus. Zeus whooped her ass real quick, hurt her real quick. And it hurt my feelings. But he didn't like try to kill her or nothing. He just, he, shit, he told her to stop. He tried to do all that growling and biting at him and shit. And he got on the ass and told her to stop. You know, and then I said, you know, I, I broke it up. It wasn't a real fight. It was just like, bitch, I will fuck you up. Stop. I'm not Chloe. I'm not Roxy. I'm not them. I am a fucking man. And I'm not finna get whooped by no female. So he did that to her. And been copacetic since then when it come down to her hanging out with the boys she don't really try stupid shit all the tail up and putting her head over the dog she don't do that with the boys that doesn't work with them they don't play that shit and maybe it's super alpha he really don't see how he's not playing with her he don't really do all that play play shit he's too focused on what he got going on Chloe went in her dog house Roxy's in her dog house Pretty sure Zeus gonna go on his too. You see how they don't have to, they don't have to bend. Really even go, they can walk straight in that mother. You see that, they, there's so much space in there. There's way too much space. I should have got the largest, listened to um, some weirdos on Facebook told me to get the XLs, which was a terrible idea. Um, it never gets too cold here, so I guess it's cool, but look how much space is inside those kennels. If you have a bully, do not get the XLs. Get the largest. It's perfect. This kennel right here, this fucking doghouse and all that shit is for like a Great Dane. A Great Dane would have to bend down to go in there and, you know, yeah, it'll stay warm because it's it'll be all fitted to them. It'll, it'll fit their body. But this doesn't really fit their body. It's just, it's like a real house in there, man. Too much space. But it is what it is. I plan to keep a couple puppies from Navy and Nyla. I also plan to keep a couple puppies from Roxy and Zeus, so they can share dog houses. They can have two, two, three or four puppies could fit in one. And as they get older, two can be in one. So two will share one. And then, yeah, so it'll be two to the kennel. Yep, so that's how I'm rocking. Maybe in the house. And Nyla will be in the house too once we figure out if she took or not. If she didn't take, then she's outside too. She's outside. So, my boy Navy, he been with me almost four years. Well, he's turning four in December. Been with me three years, three and a half years now. So I, I want him by me. He sleeps by my bed. Um, he alert me when somebody's walking past the house. He's the dog that needs to be in the house. You know what I'm saying? He don't really, I don't gotta worry about him chewing up nothing. He's not gonna chew up anything. When he wants to go, when he needs to go out, he's gonna come to you. And tell you take me out of here, he's gonna come right to you and put you put his head on your lap, his head on the bed, and he's gonna jump around, you know. So we have a good relationship, we have a good bond, we have everything like we're we're in sync, you know what I'm saying? Like I hear him. I, I can hear Navy if he make a little noise, just cause I know Navy. I've been with him for three over three years. So he's the he's the in house dog, he's chilling inside with me. Nyla, um, Nyla's a good dog too. She's a perfect house dog as well. 
Um, she she has no intention on chewing anything up. She has no intention on um, pissing or shitting in the house. She won't even piss or shit in the kennel too often. Less known shit or piss in the house. That just that just not a real thing. That, that that's not going to happen. That's not in her. So, but the other dogs they be tripping. They don't really care. Um, they're still young though. Like they're still young, so I expect young shit. But my house would not be the experiment. This house would not be an experiment. I've had several houses where I've experimented by letting them go, you know, just doing a little shit, just learning, man. It's, it's been a, a huge learning curve. But right now, um, we're not doing it anymore. Recently, Zeus chewed up, chewed on the door frame in my spare bedroom. And that's when I just said, fuck this. Um, I collapsed all the kennels inside. I went and bought dog houses. And yeah, this is what we have. This is where we are now with that. So, I was just giving y'all a quick update. I know I haven't been posting that many videos because it's been so nasty outside. The dogs look nasty. They're nasty now. They're stink. So, it's just been nasty, man. I've been uh, trying to just, just take care of them, man. I haven't been trying to hold a, a camera. But um, the sun is out. And um, a couple of days, I will wash them up. So, that'll be a video for you guys. Um, we're still waiting to see if she's pregnant or not, man. It's... I don't care anymore, bro. If she's pregnant, cool. If she's not cool, I don't really, I don't really big, man. I, don't, I haven't made any money off dogs. I've made zero dollars off dogs. Never sold a puppy before, so I don't have any type of. Ooh, I need to have a puppy. No, I don't really. I don't really care, man. I can take care of my dogs financially without any puppy or anything like that. So we're chilling. Um. Thank you guys for liking, subscribing, and commenting on the videos. It really makes a difference. When you guys like the video, it makes a huge difference. It pushes my videos out to, you know, other breeders, other people that are just interested in the breed itself. Um, as y'all can know, as y'all know, I've I've done this, man. Like, I've been doing this shit for, for a while now. And you guys were able to see the day I purchased the dog. Like, not literally the day I purchased him because I did the shit wirely, but, wirelessly, but... You guys saw me pick up every dog in this motherfucker, bro. Like, you guys saw it. Like, if you've been fucking with my channel and fucking with me, then you've seen it. You've seen me pick up every dog. To my road trip, travel, flights, everything. So, bear that in mind. Like, my puppies, when they do have puppies, they will not be cheap. Because you've seen the work I put in. You've seen the time. You've seen the scars. You've seen everything. You know what I'm saying? There's, it's not another channel like this where you can see... The purchase of a dog fucking have litter. It's like from the day I, it was fucking eight weeks to become a dad or a mother. So this is um this is it's really unique. Um, and you get to see them whenever I open the video. You get to see all the dogs. So that's unique as well. I don't really have my dogs hidden away. Um, a lot of dog breeders, a lot of dogs fight, and you won't see the dogs for months. A lot of times you'll never see the dog again. Cause they keep that dog away, but I show you guys everything, and that's what that's where I'm trying to you know be different from the other folks, like the ugly everything. I show you guys everything, you get to see it all from um from not just a breeder perspective, but just a dog owner perspective. And this is what comes with owning multiple dogs. Um, so yeah, man, make sure you like this video, share this video, leave a comment in the you know below. Um, I really don't do too much with descriptions and shit. 